Okay, today's project is seed starting. Um, I'm in zone 9B, so I have to pick out everything that I need to start for July, and I'm gonna do August a while too, because we're already mid-July. So I keep all my seeds organized by month that I need to start them. So because we're, our, our summer is basically winter, <laughs> So spring and fall are really our main gardening time, um, so we can double crop. So I've already picked out everything that I need for July and August to start. So we'll set this aside. And all right, so we're gonna start some Brussels sprouts, fennel, okra, collard greens, um, also cabbage, regular cabbage, uh, Chinese cabbage, cauliflower, also broccoli, uh, many varieties of sweet corn, I'm not sure what I'm going to do this year, uh, watermelon, and also pumpkins, chard, many varieties of chard. Uh, tomatillos and also regular tomatoes. Uh, many varieties of peppers. I'm not sure what I'm going to start this year. I'll try some of the new ones maybe. Uh, varieties of squash. So my winter squash like butternut, um, acorn squash, spaghetti squash, plenty of squash. Uh, kale, a whole variety of beans. Uh, I've got pole beans, bush beans, uh, a lot of these I direct sow, but I've noticed that the squirrels steal them. So I might be starting these in pots this year. We'll see how it goes. And I want to try some fava beans that I grew last year that I saved some seed from. So I might try these again, see how they go. All right, so that's the project of the day. I hope everybody's having a great day prepping up because food shortages are coming. All right, have a great one.